Let's now also take a look as to what's been happening a week after the pro-Trump mobs vandalized the U.S. Capitol. The country is now dealing with the aftermath from arrests to impeachment proceedings against President Trump. There is more information and also more accusations that are coming to light. The latest, of course, is Democrat lawmaker Mickey Sherrill, who's now made a pretty startling claim on Facebook. A day before the riots on the 5th of January, she had colleagues allegedly leading groups on a Renaissance tour of the building. On a Facebook Live, she said that she plans to hold those Republicans accountable for this. Not only do I intend to see that the president is removed and never runs for office again and doesn't have access to classified material, I also intend to see that those members of Congress who embedded him, those members of Congress who had groups coming through the Capitol that I saw on January 5th, a reconnaissance for the next day, those members of Congress that incited this violent crowd, those members of Congress that attempted to help our president undermine our democracy. I'm going to see that they're held accountable. Now, Cheryl did not specifically identify as to which lawmakers she saw leading groups through the Capitol, but her allegation comes as lawmakers continue to seek answers about the extent of planning and coordination behind the violent assault on the Capitol. Meanwhile, several Capitol Police officers have been suspended and more than a dozen are being investigated for suspected ties to the rioters. Now, Cheryl, in fact, took to Facebook Live to recount her experience of the Capitol attack, which left one police officer dead and more than 50 others injured. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.